Those red bands go. Alright, get into it, Charlotte. She's got the red bands on and she is shifting some wool. Look at it go. The boys line up another Lambo. Right, oh, we've got we're hunting for our top eight here. Twenty-four point four is the time to beat. Just waiting for our judges. Nine. Timekeepers. Eight. You got the thumbs up. Shearers on your marks. Set. Go. Undermine time. One, two, three big blows. And the English boy is up for Nick. He's got some sneaky little shortcuts here. Come on, Kiwi, bring it home. It's, un it's flank time, longbow time. The Kiwis are ahead by half a blow. He makes a turn quick. A bit of a wriggle there. Englishman is still on the long blow. He's done a massive long blow. Down the last side goes Paul. 20, 21 seconds gone. Looking for that button, Paul. 23, 20, 5, oh, 5. Come on, Will. You can still get in that top eight. It's a quality job, too. Hit that button. 31, 3, 7, 5. Well done, Paul. Paul Aston and Ray Hockeyanger, followed by Jade Maguire and Barney Cummins. Then Stefan Van and Joseph Winders. Ramon Smith. Three, two, Alden one, Alden Lambert. Go. Well, I think 24.4 is the time to beat. That's uh, Cody Griggs' time. See, we've got a bit of international flavour up there, Morgan. Yeah, we've got a yank. Here he'll we know, have. He'll know how to shear tough sheep. I wonder if he's got a blowout on. He's got the old Wyoming special handpiece here rattling away. But there's nothing tough about these two lambs. Pied out and the boys, they've barely left any work in them for you. They got the thumbs up. Cheers on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Rayana. Undermine time for the Yank. But Ray's up for Nick and away he's gone. Come on, Paul, don't let him get ahead of you. This Kiwi boy, he can see past that here and he's first to step over. A little bit of urgency creeping in to Paul's blows now as they float down the brisket. Coming down the last side over the shoulder. No flank to get. It's all headed for home. 23, 24. Grab that button, Paul. 26.7 and 27.28. He even had the Kiwi handshake to the old yank. Jade Maguire and Barney Cummins. Radio, three, two, one, go. Radio Radio. We'll just stay here until you boys are all organised and ready to smoke it up there. Charlotte Jefferson, Wire Rapper College, she's 13. Georgia Grant's now on the sweep. No, she's going to go for the next round. Charlotte, got the red bands on. Backwards and forwards she goes. Truck and trailer, Charlotte. Knit it together. Roll it, tie it in knots. That's it. Get it. Heave. Over she goes. She's shifting some more there, Greg. Right here, Tuma. Look at these lambs. We've got the thumbs up up the back. Shearers on your marks. Set. Go. Come on, Jay. One, two, three big undermines. But Barney's been there, done that. He's up the neck and around behind the head, dropping into that shoulder, twisting. He's making that lamb look tiny. They step over to give her. Big sweeping long blows. Jade Maguire's first on the turn. Coming down the last side now. A little bit of a wriggle. 19, 20 seconds gone. Full comb headed for home. 23, 24. Hit that button, Jade. 26.34. Come on, Barney. There's still space. 31.03. Boys, this is a golden shears. Senior speed shear. you got to bring your A game if you want to make it through to the next eight. Stefan Van and Joseph Winders. Radio. Whoops. Sorry, Morgan, you're right. You're good. Radio. Three, two, one, go. One minute again. Come on, Georgia. Very deceiving, isn't it, Wool? 
Stefan Vand and Joseph Winders. It's caught a few people out so far. Get in there, get your feet in there, whatever you need to do to shift this ball like that white line. Go, go, go. Georgia Grant, Carterton School, 12 years of age. That's the idea. Tumor Mullins, one of our sponsors, he talked about it before, about planting seeds, getting youngsters and letting that seed grow and eventually, hopefully, they're turning out to good wool handlers, presses, or shearers. Well, we're planting a seed here today at the uh, Golden Shears with these youngsters. What a privilege it is for them to be here on the stage. All right, Morgan. Righto. We got the thumbs up up the back? Not yet. Hold on, boys. Hold on. We're waiting for our timekeepers. Just waiting for a thumbs up, and then you got... 24 seconds for glory. Here we go. Shearers, on your marks. Set, go. Undermine time, Stefan. He got his handpiece connected. Well, looks for the top knot. There's none there. He wasted half a blow. And here comes Joseph. Come on, Stefan, hooking. Bend that lamb round into the flank. He goes. Long blow time for Stefan. 15, 16 seconds gone as he makes a turn. He's starting to warm up, but there's no time for a warm up. 22, 23, 24 seconds gone. He's out the last leg now. Hit that button, Stefan. Hit that button. 29, 30. Come on, Joseph. It's not a clean share. It's a quick share. Ramon right. Smith. Three, two, one, go. And Alden Lambert. All right, our next heat we have, we'll have Michael Buick here at the uh, Sweeping the Wall. Michael, make your way down. Jerome Patworth from Ekaterhuna will put you on the throwing the fleeces on the table, please. Ramon, Ramon and Alden, make your way up, please. Oh, he's big enough. He wants the two stands himself. Sorry, Aiden. The dairy farmer from Ekatahuna, he's blowing the rust and the cobwebs off his handpiece. And he says, watch me dance tonight, boys. We're waiting on a thumbs up, so grab your lamb out. Four, three, two, stop. Well done, Georgia. That's a, that's a heap of wool. Look at those lambs. Aiden, you've never seen a lamb like it. Don't waste it. We're waiting for a thumbs up from our timekeeper. So get set. Just admire that lamb for a second. Get it comfy. Not too comfy, Ramon. Yeah, we got the thumbs up. Shearers, get set. Get set up. Shearers, on your marks. Set. What are we doing? I had a thumbs up. Yeah, gave me a thumbs up. Sorry about that. Shearers, on your marks. Set. Go. Undermine time for the dairy farmer, but Ramon Smith, he's got a massive undermine. He's up for neck and away. The slam's got nothing left on. It's just a saddle. Nine, ten seconds on the turn into the long blow. Big stomping steps over. Ramon's down, making the turn first over that brisket. But here comes Aiden. Look at that hand fly out the last side. Reaching for that button, Aiden. 24, 25. Hit the button. Whoa. 25.96, he's still got it. David Gordon and Jacob Brunton. All right, can we have Michael Buick here, please? Uh, Jerome, you're over here on the um, table. Right, we've got it clean enough. You know the story here, buddy. Shift as much of that wool over there as you possibly can. Uh, this is uh, Michael Buick. Hey. 
Were you good, Greg? Yep, two greens. We're going to see a wee bit of action here. Michael Buick, Pongaroa man, of course, was in the novice wall handling today. Michael, how did that go, bud? Oh, I got eight, six. Yeah. Good work. Did you enjoy the experience? Yep. Yeah, it's magic up there, isn't it? Okay, Morgan. Right, oh. We've got the thumbs up from the timekeeper. Shearers on your marks, set, go. 24 seconds to beat. Come on, David, no mucking around. The whole family is here. Dad's even stopped sharing for the evening to come and watch you. Seven, eight seconds gone as he's into the long blow. Pacheco Brunton steps over first. The big man coming down the last side. Hurry up, David, you're getting left behind. 18, 19 seconds, and David's out the last leg. Looking for that button now, 24, 25 seconds. Hit the button, 26.43. Come on, David. 30 seconds, oh, a little bit held up on that last last little bit of a sheep. Well done, guys. Radio, three, two, one, go. Oh, Michael, giving us some steak, mate. Bringing another truck and trailer load of wool. We're gonna need it. Duncan Look at this Mac boy go. Duncan Mackay, can you come and announce this disc, please? Okay, guys, we've got one more uh, spot left in the open. One more spot left in the open. That'll be uh, until the end of the senior heats. So if there's any more open sharers out there, there's one more spot for the 24. It's just been full, filled. Someone called Tuma Mullins, his name's appeared on that. Are they running a veterans? They'll let you share the last side, apparently. Righto, we got the thumbs up. Five. Four, three, two, it's not you boys. one, stop. Wow. I reckon two. Is it just me or are these lambs getting better? Look at them. These two English boys have peered, pulled out a pair of honeys. We're just waiting for the timekeepers as soon as we get the thumbs up. Righto, shearers, on your marks, set, go. Come on, Ross. You've beat him in the shed. Beat him up in the bright lights. There's no top knot. It's like being home again. John Malseed, here we go. First in to get the shoulder off. First to step over. A tiny step from the big man as he makes a turn. 15, 16, 17 seconds gone. He's down over his shoulder. He's going back. I don't know what for. 22, 23. Out the leg. Hit that button, John. Come on now. 26.23. Hit the button, Ross. 29.8. Radio, three, two, one, go. We saw that young Michael Buick, and he got a huge round of applause. He smoked all this wool across that white line. John He's Crawford and do. Sarah Higgins. And over here, we've got Jerome Patworth, he was in the novice shearing final. So we've got a couple of experienced little guys here. They're just not seeds, they're little seedlings. They're starting to sprout already, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, he loads up again. Running time now, Greg. Seems like he's been going for ages, but he's down to the fiddly, he's down to the crumbs. Keep on going, Michael. Grab your Still got 12 land seconds to go. Go, Michael. Go, go, go. How's the big dig going? Duncan Five, McKay. Four, three, two, stop. Wow. Duncan you McKay. Hardly any more wall to grab, mate. All right, we got the thumbs up. Johnny, just keep up with Sarah and you'll be right. Shearers on your marks, set, go. Hooking, oh, Sarah, no mucking around. She's just got off the plane, a little bit jet lag. No time for a top knot. Here we go up the neck. Johnny's into the long blow already. He steps over. Johnny Crawford, 11 seconds gone, and he's turning to the last side. 14, 15 as he comes over the shoulder now. Down the flank and out the last side. 
looking for that button, Johnny Crawford. Here comes Sarah. Hurry up, she can catch her from here. Oh, 25.18. Come on, Sarah. You're cruising. 31.95. Right, three, two, one, go. You're right, Jerome. Come on, mate. Move that wall. Come on, you're not going to have your mate. Your mate from down the road or up the road. I'm not familiar that way. But across the fence anyway. It's the backward stride. He's using his back muscles. We've got a fan club right with him too. Oh, what a big time he's having. Jerome Patworth. Moving the whole stack. Michael Buick's looking over saying, hey mate, you're gonna beat my record. Come on, Michael, that's it. You've got to stitch it together. Hold it nice and tight. That's the boy. That's how it's done. Here's a mighty shift. 49, still 10 seconds to go. He's down to the crumbs as well. Brooms upside down. Got it sorted. Three, two, one, stop. I think that deserves a round of applause, folks. He shifted a power wall as well. Power wall. All right, our next heat after these two will be Archie Woodhouse from Ekatahuna. Archie will put you down on the shifting down the front there, shifting the wall. And a Jake McIntyre from Alfredden School uh, on the wall table. Lance, can you put the top eight on the screen? We're going to have our top eight share off for our seniors. Now, talking about seniors, all the senior kids here in this event, there will be a little fine, all the top two, OK? So you'll realise you are being judged on all this, and there will be a little final for you. Righto. Those, those times, yeah. the, you've made the top eight, but they mean nothing now. We're going to yep, take the good. top four. We're going to find the four fastest shares, fastest senior shares. Those top eight. Raylene's going to give me the draw in about a second. We're going to have a face-off. Thanks, Morgan. Three, two, one, go. Here we go. Let's stay with Jerome from Mecca Tahuna. Can you see where you're going, mate? He's got wool all over him. That's the boy. Truck and trailer load. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. Excitement of peace. Big, big loads. This novel shearing, novice shearing finalist. Another big load. He's loading it up. He's got a big pick okay. of these two boys. Sorry, Gerald. Okay, heat number one of the uh, Festus semi finals will be Jade and John Melseed. Second heat will be Aidan Lambert. Steve Jane. Heat three will be Johnny Crawford, Paul Swan. Final heat, Lionel, Tomata, and Cody Greig. Okay, so can we give the first heat up, guys? Jade and John. Right, well, you, you're all good, Greg. Yep. No rest, Jerome. Right, you know the rules. Three, two, one, go, Michael. Here we go. Give him some positive energy, folks. Jade and John, you guys can get here. up. We'll get the names on the screen shortly. Okay, just give me a call, cool, uh, Tuma, when you're ready to go. Otherwise, Jerome Patworth is on fire down here. He is responding from his mates. Oh, yeah. Another load. That's the one we want. It's sitting there. It's the easy fruit. Easy picking. Patworth. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. The JCB's in town. Oh, hold it, mate. Oh, Wow. Just about lost your balance. No, you can keep going. Don't take a break. You're not out of diesel, are you? 
Keep going, mate. You jump into the reserve tank. Come on in. Give him some hand. He's in the reserve petrol tank. Two seconds to go. One second to go. Break. Give him a round of applause, though, folks. That was a, a tremendous effort of uh, stamina and self-control and self-discipline to drive himself as hard as he did. Okay, Lance, we're just waiting on the names on the, on the screens, mate. Watch your head, John, as you walk in there. Oh, the shearers aren't supposed to walk in the pen, mate. Uh, they'll be in there trying to pick their sheep. He couldn't walk in there. They'd have to stoop, crawl in there anyway. I'm sure if there's a good one at the back, he'll find a way. Arms like that, he'd get anywhere, wouldn't he? Get, get into your pen. All right, just while we're waiting for those names there, our next ones, I'll just change those heats because it's just getting later. We'll get a couple of these youngsters up here. Can we have a Kaylee Jury? We will put you here instead just at the moment, please, and we'll stand the other ones down. And Thomas Herrick will put you on the, the wool table here. So little Thomas, out you come, buddy. And um, Kaylee a Jury from Masterton here. But what did you think of Michael Buick, who was in the wool handling here today, and he just left the board? And what did you think of Jerome Patworth from Ekatahuna, who was also in the novice shearing final? Did they work hard up here, or did they not? Give them a round of applause. That was a sensation ever by those two boys. You might see them again in the final. Right, we've got Thomas. Is Kaylee still about? Kaylee, oh, yeah, you're over there, Kaylee. Right, yeah, you ready to go? Our next heat is Aidan Lambert and Steve Jane. Thomas, Thomas here. Johnny Crawford and Steve and and Paul Swan and Cody Gregg and Lionel Taumata. All right, we'll get them underway while we're waiting on the names. Three, two, one, go. That's it, Thomas. Get into it. Little Thomas Herrick of Carterton and Kaylee Jury of Masterton. Give it a big throw. Get some ear time on it. That's it, Thomas. Oh, that's it. Get into it, mate. That's it. That's it. Get your feet going. Whatever it takes. We just said move it to here. Hop down on your hands and knees and get your head in there and bulldoze it if you want to. That's okay. There's nothing in the fine print that says you can't do that. Kaylee. Chucking these fleeces, wrapping them up. These fleeces are starting to get dizzy. They're going on the table, off the table. They're starting to wonder what's going on here. Righto. We've got the thumbs up out the back. Grab your lambs, boys. We're taking the top four. There's room for both of you at the moment. You just got to set the pace. Stretch those lambs out. Shearers on your marks, set, go. Into it and be undermined. Jade McGuire is up the neck first. One, two, three blows. He's turning in now. It's all about that turn and stepping over into the long blow now. <laughs> Jade McGuire leading the way home. 13, 14, 15 seconds. He's down the last side. He'll be looking for that button in under 22. Come on, Jade. Oh, 22.42. 26. Come on, John. Well, Sean, is it good enough for the judges? Aiden Lambert, come on up. Radio Tone. Three, two, one, go. Go, Thomas. Aiden and Steve, make your way up there. That's it, boy. Grab some big handfuls. Get down there. That's the man. A he shout out to uh, BMC Pastoral for uh, supplying these lambs. Beautiful animals. And a uh, shout out to Pine Archer and his crew for uh, preparing them. It probably took them three times the amount of time that these guys are sharing them in. It's a big job. I don't know. Have you seen that pied arse crutch? Holy hell. Still dags in the legs when he does it. But it's quick. 
And the lambs even look like they enjoy it. 22 seconds. Drive the cows off, Aiden. This is your glory days. We got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for the dairy cocky. Put Steve's up for Nick. Steve Jane, first to drop into that shoulder now. Come on, follow me, Aiden. Nine seconds as they step over for the long blow. A bit of a wriggle for Steve. And Aiden's caught him over the brisket, down the flank, headed for home. Under 20 seconds, Aiden. Hit that button. No time to clean up. 21.88. 23.74. Don't look away, we're only going to get quicker. Righto, Johnny Crawford and Paul Swan. Come on up. Ooh, judges didn't Three. like that one, Aiden. Oh. Three, two, one go. Need that. You need the gum boots back, Aiden. Oh well. That's the idea, Thomas. Hang the mockies up for another year. That's a boy. You're getting some three pointers there. You can't place it in there, can you? You've got to take a shot from the back, straight off the backboard and straight in. We're just waiting for the thumbs up. We got the thumbs up from the timekeeper. We'll rip into it. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Come on, Johnny. Go, Johnny. Here we go up for Nick. Johnny, be good. He's looking for the prize money here. Seven, eight seconds gone as he steps over. But Paul Swan's been there, done that. Up the neck, round behind the head. Coming down that brisket now. Who's going to bring us home? 17, 18 seconds gone as they're out the leg. 21, 22, hit that button. 23.18. Come on, Paul. No mucking around. 27.09. Come on, Cody. It's revenge time for Lionel. You put me last time. Watch out, young fella. I got told as a young fella, you don't poke a sleeping bear. Levin represents... You ready? Three, two, one, go, Kaylee. Go, mate. Go, Thomas. That's a boy. Chuck it up. Come on, Thomas. Look at him go. The fleece is as big as he is. You're right, Morgan. It's a bit of a quality. We've got the thumbs up. Shearers on your marks. Set, go. Undermine time for Lionel, undermine time for Cody. Lionel's first one up the neck. Big sweeping blows. He's a bit of wriggle in the lamb. And here comes Cody. He's coming back for you, Lionel. Don't relax now. Cody Gregg up around the head, making the turn onto the last side. 17, 18, 19 seconds gone. Stepping back now. Cody Gregg, he's, Gregg, he's leaning into it. Down at the last leg. 25, 26. But here comes Lionel. 28, 29 seconds. Yeah. We're just, it's just, we're just judging these sheep out the back. You've got to get a green light to get through. Cody, Cody, hang out. 40 seconds. Just a bit of politeness, Cody. Green light. Yeah. All right, Kayla, you've got one event to go. How's it going out there? How hard is it? A little bit hard. Do you have a lot of respect for shearers and wall handlers and pressers now? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and the World Wide Web. Welcome along to Golden Shears Night on a Thursday here in the mighty Wairarapa. And uh, we have uh, uh, 
fantastic event going on this evening. It's the Cavalier uh, speech here, and we start off with veterans, and uh, it's our privilege to welcome Duncan Mackay into the studio. Duncan, thank you, welcome. Yeah, yeah, welcome. Thank you. Hey, um, look, it's uh, your, 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 uh, your job with uh, Cavalier. Yeah, um, I'm a uh, production manager there. I've um, been there about well, nine years, and uh, we've been through some changes recently. Uh, we brought out the opposition, and um, consequently, uh, flat out at the moment, scaring wool and uh, <laughs> shipping it, and um, yeah, pushing things along. You are, you're adding value. We are adding value, that's for sure, uh, in an environmentally friendly way oh, as well. Cool. So we're not uh, we're not doing any harm to the mighty uh, Mother Nature or Mother Earth. No, no. Hey, hey, uh, Duncan. Look, it's it's quite neat. But where do you guys f see the fit uh, at the Golden Shears? What what what's uh, what's attracted you folk to the Golden Shears? Because it's a wonderful event to be involved in. Well, um, the company um, likes to promote wool and. Um, the best way, or one of the ways to do it is events like this which um, gather around people at the grassroots of the industry um, and we see that promoting it is going to uh, well, hopefully have a good flow on effect. Oh great. And uh, it was quite pleasant to see um, children involved in wool handling and um, getting their own little experiences <laughs> from the industry uh, and there's plenty of them cool. <laughs> as we all know. So. Uh, yeah, well, tonight we were just watching what's going on here. This is a new thing. The Golden Shears is always trying to evolve, trying to bring new things to the front. You involve children, and who comes with children? Well, the adults. Mum and Dad. <laughs> so we're filling up our stadium. Yeah, for the kids to do and, and wear them out. Yeah, them out well, and, uh, yeah. Oh, it's congratulations to the Golden Shears um, for organising that. And uh, who actually owns Cavalier? Um, Cavalier... As a group, owns uh, around 15%, and the balance is spread between um, Capital Direct and uh, Lempriere and ACC. Wow, well, so those folks there, and uh, all going well. We'd like to uh, see um, further involvement with the Cavalier team, and uh, I'm sure, I think you mentioned there's something like about $2,000 involved tonight? Yeah, I believe so. Um, yeah, that's the prize money up for grabs, and... Um, I'm sure it's it's worth turning up for, and uh, I think we'll see some pretty good efforts tonight. Oh, and, uh, yeah, competition's a great thing. Great. Yeah. Well, we've just seen the seniors. Now we're going into the open, fellas, and I think those senior guys showed them about 21 seconds. What do you think of that? Oh, I was amazed, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be about 21 minutes. So, uh, <laughs> and then yeah. we got we got the open boys, and I think tonight we might see a sheep short in about 17 seconds. What do you reckon? Is that your pick? Oh, I think well, we better we'll be put a fiver on it and <laughs> see how we go. <laughs> hey, Duncan, thank you very much for taking the time, coming down and um, being part of the Golden Cheers family and um, Cavalier wonderful company and we look forward to many years to work with you guys. Oh great, yeah we'll definitely be back next year Th and uh, sponsor oh. some more hopefully. We'll Thank see. you Duncan. Here we go. Walking up there. Um, oh. What stands are they on? Jimmy, Jimmy, is that Eddie? Oh yeah, sweet. See that, see, oh see it on the line. Oh yeah, yeah, see, yeah of course, yeah, three. We need three, don't we? Fast Eddie. Because yeah, the other ones are all older guys, aren't they? Yeah. That's Eddie Aranui. That's Eddie. We're not Rob Yeah. We'll just get those screens Stop stands, done. guys. Well, if you've uh, got anything to do with sharing worldwide, you'd know that Jimmy Samuels, that's the guy on number two. Jimmy Superfly, he's been winning many spare chairs, breaking records, and breaking a few hearts of some of these other guys, hasn't he, uh, Morgan? Yeah, they tell me that. He's a pretty fierce competitor. We're well, just waiting. Grab your lambs out. We've got the thumbs up. We'll rip into it. Right, you right to go, mate. We'll just get these teams going. Three, two, one, go. That's not you guys. Beautifully crutched lambs. Get comfy. And on my Come mark. Go, man. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for the Superfly. Two blows. He's got the neck falling on the floor already. Making the turn to... 
Holy hell, Jimmy Samuels stepping over. We haven't got a clock, but he's coming down the last side. 10, 11, 12 seconds gone. He's out that leg. He reached for that button, Jimmy. Oh, we'll get the times to you soon. Come on, Eddie. Green lights. Three, two, one, stop. Our times are up the top, guys, just for a bit of confusion. 18.862 for Jimmy Samuels. 28.792 for Eddie Aranui. Two green lights, well, Sean Lambs. Okay, can we have uh, Thomas Herrick up here? We had two juniors in here. We had a seven and an eight-year-old, Kaylee Jury and uh, Thomas Herrick. Righto. Can you just make your way up here? Jump over here, mate. There's royalty in the house. On behalf of the Golden Shears. Stacey oh, no, Tahuya and Matt Tamohi, the battle of the giants. Where well done, Kaylee. I hope that stage is strong enough. Come on, Matt. Square up. Up after them, Hayden Tap and Hemi Braddock. And then Ringa Paiwai and Padata Abraham. Ethan Pankhurst. Versus Corny Roberts. Martin e. Mason versus Axel Reed. James Tudavahi versus Jack Fagan. Joe Van Tyke versus Casey Bailey. Righto, we got the thumbs up from our timekeeper. Come on, Matt. Share is on your marks, set, go. Watch this, man. Look at that slow, full hand. Up the neck goes Matt, but here comes Stacey to who you. You got to bring your A game. You got to give it your all if you want to beat Stacey in a speed share. Come on, Matt, making the turn together now. Coming down the last side together. 16, 17 seconds gone. 18, 19, reaching for that button. Oh, Matt's got him. And Stacey, Matt to me, 22.31. Stacey, 23.69. Beautiful. Three, two, one, go, mate. Come on, Archie, shift that wall, buddy. Hayden, tap. And, and Hemi Braddock. That's it, Archie. Get down there, fill up that fadge, get into it. Watch your mate over here. Jake, how are you getting on? This is probably not your ground over here. You're doing a bit of sorting, mate. You want that rough and tumble stuff, bit of scrag. Not that sort of dainty bits and pieces here. That's it, mate. Get as much as you can, Archie. You've got your fan club right here beside you. They've got a ring seat. Going for it. How's the time going there? 54. He's got five, four, three, two, one, and tools down. Well done, Jake. That's a full fadge. If there was one, we've only got a few crumbs left. Righto, we've got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Come on, Hayden, the Southlander. Oh, two sweeping, flowing undermine, and he's up the neck. Come on, Hemi, do it for you, get a hoona. But all here cheering you on. Hayden, tap steps, flowing around that last one. Look at that hand go. 13, 14, 15 seconds gone. That lamb's trying to stretch out. 18, 19, hitting that button, Hayden. Come on now. Oh, Hemi's got you. 
Woohoo! 25, 26 seconds. No chance to relax on these two lambs. Ring of Pai Wai and Pirata Abraham. Right. We've got action a piece here on the board and out the back. Three, two, one, go. Come on, Archie from Megatahuna. Bring the house down. Hey man, Pai Arata is going to try that in a wee minute or two with a speech here. But at the moment, it's Archie Woodhouse from Megatahuna. He's 16 years of age and he is shifting some wool. He once again should have been in the pressing. Early this morning, and over here we've got Jake McIntyre. Two red lights, Alfredin. boys. Grab your lambs out, we've got the thumbs up. There's going to be a final in this event, boys, so work hard. You've got a couple activities to go. You are the last two standing. Shifting the wall, 43 seconds. Over to you, Morgan. Let rip. The Cousins. The Y Rapper Cousins. Who's got this? Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Come on, Pirata. Is that the one you marked out for yourself? Up the neck he goes. He's got a bouncy style. Six, seven, eight seconds as he steps over for a long blow. Come on, Ringer. Don't let him get ahead of you. 12, 13. He's looking for it. Jimmy Samuels. 15, 16. Full last side. 18, 19. Hit that button, boy. 21.18. Come on, Ringer, keep it clean. 25.99. Ethan Pankhurst and Corny Roberts. Yep, we're good to go. Jake, you ready, mate? One minute. Three, two, one, go. One minute to go. Two green Jake lights. Alfred in. Shifting that wall. Ethan's in the top four of the national circuit, national open sharing circuit. One to watch, they reckon. And Corny Roberts is right there with him. 18 seconds is the seal time. Look at that lamb, Ethan. We got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Cheers on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Corny. One, two, up the neck. He flies. Three, four seconds gone as he's making the turn. Seven, eight as he steps over for the long blow. Come on, Corny, bring it home. 11, 12, and he's making the turn now. <laughs> 15, 16 seconds, full last side. Here we go, Corny Roberts. 21 seconds gone, he's hitting the button. Hit the button, Corny. Come on, Ethan. You're not down south anymore. 28, 29, 30 seconds. There's a bit of life in these lambs. Martini Mason and Axel Reed. Two big names already. Right, last in a final event down here. Three, two, one, go. Come on, Jake, I hear he starts loading up the bottom box of the press. This is what it's like in the shed. You have this big pile, in this case, second shear or lamb's wool. Very similar. The wool handlers make this big pile, and then you've got to start hoeing into it. In this case, Jake's got one minute to shift as much as he possibly can. Over here doing all the ballet dancing and just was the that, little stuff. Was that money changing hands there, Martini? Did he He's pick up. you a good one? Look at these lambs. Wow. We've got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Shearers on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Martin. He makes it up and Nick, he goes. Three, four, five seconds gone. He's turning into the long blow now. Seven, eight as he steps over. 
and Axel's right there with him. They're racing all the way, blow for blow. <coughs> Martin, he's stolen the head now over the brisket. Head down the flank, out the last side now. Who's got the quickest? Who did the biggest undermine? Hitting the button. Axel Reed by a whisker. 24.17 versus 24.29. James Tudavahi versus Jack Fagan. 18 seconds, the time to beat. Right, that's all the uh, juniors and the seniors done down here. We're going to um, take five minutes. Sorry, Jack. Yes. You got mate? Casey. We'll take five minutes and um, get the points added up and we're going to have the, a sheer off, as I have to say, down here for the top two. So we're going to have a little final. Over to you, Morgan. We've got... Is it a thumbs up? We've got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Grab your lamb, Casey. Otherwise, James, we finish before you grab it. He's hungry. He skipped dinner for this. Beautiful woolly lambs. Right, oh. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for James Tudavahi. Up one, big sweeping blows, looks for a top knot. Up the neck and around he goes. Casey Bailey, eight seconds as he's dropping into the flank. 10, 11 for stepping over. Long blow time. Come on, James. <coughs> Casey turns first. Down the last side, they go together. Who did the most homework? Who's got the quickest last side? Casey Bailey. He's going to be looking for that button any second now. Ooh, James to the <coughs> Point two of a second. Two green lights, Ian Kirkpatrick and Bodine Hawkins. Twenty-five point nine two was the time they need to get under. That's held by Ringa Kaha. They're taking eight through into the semi-final, and then from the eight will go down to four. Cavalier, Corporation are the sponsors of the Open Speed Chair. Thank you very much to our sponsors. Righto, we got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Bodine Hawkins. Cheers. On your marks, set, go. One, two. Sweeping blows from Bodine Hawkins. Up the neck. Ian Kirkpatrick right there with him as they're turning together. Here we go. Into the long blow time. Stepping over, making the turn. Ian slightly ahead now. He's half a blow ahead. Can he keep it? Bodie's had to go back. Down the last side, headed for home. Hit that button. That was a 21.55 and 
Okay, the final here of these uh, seniors in the Come and near, near, and DJ Crawford. Can we have Archie Woodhouse, please, and uh, Michael Buick? All the other senior competitors, before you take off, the uh, Golden Shears Committee are going to give you a, a little bag with a few um, wee goodies in it. So that's all the competitors. But at this stage, this is the... What's you two young fellas again? Archie Woodhouse. So Archie will put you here. Michael will put you over there. You're starting on the uh, wall table. Same, same drill, mate. The big finale. But there will be bags brought round to all you senior competitors, so just make yourself known to one of the Golden Shears committee members if you see them walking around looking for you. Radio, are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Not you boys, not you boys. Hold on. We got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Righto, shearers, on your marks, set, go. 18 seconds to beat. He's a quick little lambs. There's nothing left on him. Round the neck into the first shoulder. Tamania Nia has got the early lead. Holy hell, he's quick. Come on now, chuck it out quick, Tama. Hit that button and get it down. He must have always a bit of wriggle in DJ's lamb. Holy hell. Hit the button, Tama. Get rid of that lamb quick. DJ Crawford, bring it home. Ooh. Ooh, these lambs are showing a little bit of life. That's uh, two of the boys, the Gizzy Bros. Okay, let's get our next heat up on the board. We're just waiting on the names on to come up on the board. Three, two, one, go. You got us another couple of names up there, Lance. Done job. All right, just while we're waiting on the uh, next two competitors up there, we've got Archie uh, Woodhouse here, right down, scavenging up the little wee few crumbs. He's still got 40 seconds up his sleeve. He's going to be uh, going for the old smoko box early. No work to done, to be done. The boss says, what are you doing, Archie? He says, I'm wrapped, finished, got the T-shirt. Down to the few little crumbs now with five seconds to go. Digger Barman, Floyd Neal. Finale. Done. Digger Barman, and Floyd Neal. Jack Fagan. And Javan Tiaki. Oi, quick bop on the head for the young fella. <laughs> the old gun's feeling confident tonight. He's in a good mood. He just said, follow me, Floyd. I'll show you how to do it. I've been doing this since you were in nappies. Oh, that makes him smile too. He's fit as anything. Dig a bomb. We got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Shearers, on your mark, set, go. No mucking around. Come on, Floyd, two blows up for Nick. Floyd Neal, come on, he says, bop me on the head. I'll see you in the final. Stepping over eight, nine seconds gone. Long blow time. 
First to turn is Digger Bum. We got a race on our hands down the last side to give a short, sharp blows from Digger, and he's going to hit that button first. Digger Bum! I'll bop you anytime I want, young fella. Well, Sean. Ready? Go. Get into it. Jack and Joven, come on up. Right, just while they're getting organised up here, Archie once again on the big shifting of the wall. This young guy over here, Michael Buick. He's shifting stacks of this wall. Look at him go, these young fellas. It's been so good. We've had the entries have been way above what we were expecting, of course. We're still chiselling through them now, but we're down to the big finale. This fun event to get these youngsters involved in the wool industry. Grab your lambs, boys. We've got the thumbs up from a time to keep it. We're looking for the fastest eight. You've got to be under 23 seconds, I reckon, to bump out Martini and bump out Axel. There's space for both of you if you want it enough. Shearers on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Fagan. Javan's up the neck and around into the first shoulder. Surprised he can see past that moustache, but it filters out the dust. He's got a full lung full of air, and he's making the turn quick now. 12, 13 seconds gone. Full wet comb up, punch it home. 16, 17, hit that button, Javan. Come on now, 20 seconds gone. Hit the button. Ooh, 22.93 and 24.25. Have you done enough, Jack? Well done, Javan. Green light. Rightio, are you ready to go, boys? On your answer set, go. Well, young Buick managed to sweep the floor clean. He was going for the um, early feed out of the Smoko box, the tuck box as well. And he's knitting it all together. He's been in and around sheds a lot, this boy from Pongaroa. Kicking it all with his feet, getting it all bundled up. Says this is how. Righto. Brett Roberts versus Stacey Tahuya. You guys get ready, just. Don't rush for computer, but start cruising up now. Javan versus Matt. Ian versus Digger. Two local favourites. Pirata versus the Superfly. Hoo hoo. We're All looking right. for the top four. Three seconds to go, two, and a squint. You had no more bloody will to sort any young fella. You had it all sorted up. Okay, you're ready, mate. On your marks, get set, go. Go, Archie. Buick in the wall handling today. Now on this fun event, along with a lot of other children. Okay, can we get our shearers up on the board? Stacey Tahuya and Brett Roberts. Archie doing the big dig over here. How you going, Archie? You're getting two piles of wool, but is it the clean wool and the dirty wool, or is it just two piles of wool? But there's big piles going in here. Young Buick. The last and final steps of this event. We've got 10 seconds to go and we've been there, done that and dusted it. Five, four, three, two, one. That is us. We'll do some presentations and it'll be all good. Don't get your sheep yet, guys. We don't quite know which stand you're on. Because we're sharing an order of qualification. So these guys snuck in. 
They beat Axel and Jack. They snuck in there. We're going to nah, just leave your lamb, leave your lamb, Stacey. We don't know for sure. We're waiting for the computers to load your name up. We're good. Look at those lambs. We got the thumbs up from a timekeeper. Come on, Corny. Shearers on your marks, set, go. Undermine time, early start for Brett Roberts. He's a way up for Nick. Come on now, Corny. Here comes Stacy. He's dropping into that long blow. He's got the slow hand, but it's a full comb. Long blow time, making the turn first is Corny Roberts. <coughs> 16, 17 seconds gone. <coughs> 19, 20, 22, hit the button. Ooh, Stacy. 24.11, 24.8087. So we're Ian. looking for the top four. Uh, keep your gear on, guys. Stacy and uh, Brett. Okay, I'll just quickly go through this prize giving while we're waiting on the next two speed cheers to go up there. So the winner out of these two, there was the uh, Michael Buick and the Archie Woodhouse. And this year, in this lovely little fun event, the winner is Archie Woodhouse. So Archie, please come on over. And um, on behalf of the uh, Golden Cheers Committee and Philip Morrison, grab a, a prize there, mate. Second place goes out to Michael Buick. Michael, make your way over, mate, from Pongaroa. Well done, buddy. All of you... Um, Senior competitors in this fun event, come over and get a, um, your goodies put here, please. Millie H H Higginbottom, Georgia Higginbottom, Bridie King, Manaya Patworth, Dallas King, Amanda Jeffson, Charlotte Jeffson, Georgia Grant, Michael Buick, we've done, Jerome Patworth, Archie Woodhouse, uh, Jake McIntyre, I think that's some more, but if you had a go, please make your way up. That's it, Marston. Give him a round of applause. These are your future of the uh, wool hunters have all partaken. And um, there was tremendous entry, so that was good to make time for them. Well, you guys are in for a real treat tonight. It's not often you get to see Brett Roberts and Stacey Dehuia share off twice in front of you. But tonight you're going to. They sure the wrong lambs in. We're going to share some faster ones now. Righto, we got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. These lambs are even better. 
If you look really close, you'll see Corny's actually smiling. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Stacey. Up the neck he goes, there's nothing on the neck. Corny's first to turn, who's got the fullest comb? Stepping over Corny's, it's half a blow ahead, making the turn, coming down 12, 13, 14 seconds gone. Come on, Stacey, here comes Stacey. Who's got that button? Stacey to who ya? Hoo-hoo! 20.49 versus 20.50. Righto, heat to Javan Raiki and Matt Tamohi. Righto, we got the thumbs up, timekeepers. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. He undermined time. Javan's up the neck, come on, Matt. Don't let the little fella with a big mo get ahead of you. Seven, eight seconds gone as they step over. Up the long blow, 11, 12. Here comes Javan, little chip shot, and he's down the last side, whooshing out that last leg. Hit the button, Javan, quick. 20.95. Met to my twenty three point three. Ian Kirkpatrick and Digger Bam. See how Ian's walking behind Digger. He doesn't want to bop, but Digger's just here to bop. So we're taking the top four. Once these uh, open competitors have uh, shown, we're going to go into the seniors, the senior final. We're going to have a senior top four after this. We've got the thumbs up from the timekeeper. Grab your sheep. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Digger Balm. He's up the neck. He's got a little honey of a lamb. Dropping into the first shoulder. Flank falls off. Stepping over now. Nine, ten seconds gone. He makes a turn. Eleven, twelve. Here comes Digger Balm. Down the last side. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen seconds gone. Hit the button, Digger. Nineteen point eight two for Ian. 19.65. Ian missed out on the bop. He earned some respect. Jimmy Samuels, the Superfly, and Pirata Abra Hulk. Green light for Digger. Red light for Ian. Twenty point nine five. We're taking the top four.
senior semi-finalists, get yourselves ready, guys. You'll be on straight after. Timekeepers are ready. Look at that lamb, Jimmy. He wants to let it run around so he can really admire it. Tight If you look really close, there's a little smile there. This is where it's time to shine. Shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time for Superfly up the neck. They go together, dropping into that shoulder now. The transition into the long blow, stepping over first, Superfly making the turn first. He's half a blow ahead. No time to get stuck up, no time to go back. 15, 16, 17, hitting the button, 18.81. What do the judges think? 18 flat and 18.818. Ooh, harsh call. Red light. Green light for Pardata. Heat one of our senior semi-final. Lionel Talmata and Cody Gregg facing off. And Jade and Steve, you're up next. We're gonna find the final. We're gonna find our two fastest senior speed sharers. Oh, so we're going to find our fastest shearer. This is our final. It's not a semi, this is our final. Righto, make your way up, Cody and Lionel. So this is the final, ladies and gentlemen. The Supreme Automotive Refinishes are the sponsor of this event. It's a two-stand final. So it's the fastest time taken from these four shearers. Prizes go all the way down to fourth place. A purple heads. The, your guys' lamb should have purple heads in there, guys. Cody. Your guys' finalist sheep should be, have purple heads. Cody, does your lamb have a purple head? Does your lamb have a purple head? Does and it, it look should, be, should be orange for the open. Does it look pretty, Cody? Has it got mascara? Is it your type, Cody? 
It is. There's a thumbs up from Cody. We've got a thumbs up from our timekeeper. Here we have. Grab your lambs. Oh, heck. No wonder he's got a big smile on his face. Why isn't Lionel smiling? Look at those lambs. Those lambs look better than their girlfriends. Depends what you're into, Tommy. <laughs> These lambs have been grown by BMC Pastoral for us. Righto, shearers, on your marks, set, go. Undermine time to give her. Up the neck first goes Lionel. Four, five seconds go. Here comes Cody Green, stepping over. Long blow time, making the turn. Come on, Cody. Here comes Lionel down the last side. 16, 17 seconds gone. Come on, hit the button, Lionel! Whoo! He finally got him. He got him. Do you reckon he was just l tricking him the whole time? You can have the heats, but I'll take the final. Full heat. sense of security. Heat two, Jade and Steve. Steve Jane, Jade Maguire. Oh, the red light. Unlucky, Cody. Green light for Lionel. 21 seconds, the time to beat. Steve's got the comb to do it. We got the thumbs up from a timekeeper. Look at that crutching job. Wow. Shearers. On your marks, set, go. Under my time. Steve Jane, sweeping blows, bounces up the neck. Come on, Steve. Here comes Jane, making the turn into the long blow together. Eight, nine, ten seconds gone for the long blow. Coming down the last side, 12, 13, 14. Fill that comb up, bring it home. Hit that button, Jade. You've got this. The money's yours. 21.8, 22.248. Righto. Now that was our senior final. Hope you didn't blink because you would have missed it. Our top four open final. Javan Taiki and Corny Roberts and Digabam and Parata Abraham. This is the final of our Cavalier Corporation, Cavalier Wall Scows. Open speed share. First prize, $800. First prize of our seniors is going to walk away $500 richer. Not bad for 21 seconds work, is it, Morgan? Yeah, man. An enjoyable 21 seconds of those lambs. BMC Pastoral, they've really produced a perfect speed share lamb. We're just waiting for our names to come up on the screen. Our names. Your name, Tomo. Nice. No, the names of the open shearers, our open finalists.
This open final is going to be pretty quick. If you're still sharing it, 20 seconds, there won't be much prize money left for you. Corny and Javan, come on up. He's taking time out from his job as a police officer, Javan. Turned up to have a go at sharing. Turns out he's quite good, Tuma. He's, uh, he's knocked a few of the big boys off here tonight. He's probably just warming up too. We've got young Brett, he's not in. Yeah, not long been in the open and he's uh, really stomping his mark as well, isn't he? Look at that lamb, it's a little beauty. A little hummers. We got the thumbs up from a timekeeper. Shearers. On your marks, set, go. Undermine time. Corny Roberts is up and Nick Javan's right there with him. He's a beautiful lamb. Stepping over Javan's first. Eight, nine, ten seconds gone. And now down the last side, headed for home. Come on, Corny. Look at the big man fly. 17. Hit the button. 18.5. 18.72. Dig a bomb. Pada to Abraham. Well, those two young fellas are really. Ooh. It's going to say set the benchmark. But no good if they've both got red lights. No, not yet. We're only corny. This is a Javan. It's a quick shear, but you still got to take all the wool off. What wool? Just the fleece wool that's left on. Those little saddles. We're just waiting for the thumbs up, guys. Chill out for a bit. Waiting for the thumbs up. Just chill out, chill out for a bit. We're just waiting for the lights on too, I think, are we? Oh, we've got a red light there as well. Right, oh, we got the thumbs up from the timekeepers. Holy hell, look at the crutch on that one. The sheep up there, Tommy. Shearers. On your marks, set, go. One, two blows for Digger. Up the neck goes Bidata. He's starting to shake. He's starting to move. Five. Oh, Digger steps over first. Long blow time. He makes a turn. He's got some tricks. 11, 12, 13 seconds gone. Digger bomb down the last side. Hit that button. 18, 19. Come on, boy. Ooh. What are the judges going to say? 18.24 seconds. Watch those lights. Judges out the back, they're evaluating the sheep. Pirata got a green. Well, they're a bit hard out there at the moment, aren't they, these judges? We just want a fair job. We want to consistently all the wool off. No full staples, no big cuts, no oh, cuts. want, want, want. My goodness. <laughs> you sound like a married man, Tomo. <laughs> and a green light for Digger.
do we have any the Cavalier rep or or Supreme Auto? Are you here? Do we have any reps here? They wanna. ready for sharing. If it hadn't been for the loud bang and the flag and pour hit me in the nuts. And it hurts for about five minutes and then, uh, you know, over the next few weeks it'll drop off. For advice on protecting yourself as well as everything else on your farm or business, talk to FMG, ask around about us or call 0800 366 466. FMG, we're here for the good of the country. More than a million acres are farmed in the broad Wairarapa Valley. This is grand sheep country, and to promote worldwide interest in New Zealand wool, the Wairarapa Federated Farmers are staging the first Golden Shears International Shearing Championship. Farmers flock to Masterton, largest town in the area, for the championship finals. And even the townsfolk are excited at the prospect of seeing Australasia's top shearers in action. Scene of the finals is the sports stadium beside Masterton Civic Pool. The six competitors in the intermediate championship all make fast starts, but points are not given for speed alone. Quality of workmanship is the most important consideration, and it's a feature of the contest that some of the fastest shearers fall into minor placings when their overall points are totaled. Australian John Allen sets the pace. These young experts will be the gun shearers of tomorrow. Allen finishes first and is awarded the highest total of points, 87 out of a possible 100. The Australasian Blade Shearing Championship is an event which really interests the North Island audience. These days, blades are used only in the southern high country. Machines are not favoured there as they cut too close to the skin for the cold climate. So all finalists are from the South Island. In this contest, the boys are shearing Romney Marsh sheep. Blades are mostly used on the finer merino wool. George Karaitiana, who has blade shorn 230 sheep in a day, wins the championship. Second place goes to his brother, Paul. Now the Open Machine Championship, fought out between Potai, McDonald, Harrison, Saar from Australia, and Ivan and Godfrey Bowen, each man to shear 20 sheep. McDonald broke his collarbone two weeks before the contest and works with his arm in tape. Saar finds the Romney sheep difficult to handle after the docile Merino. Ivan Bowen's going for his life. Ivan Bowen finishes a sheep and goes in for another. He's shearing faster than anyone else on the board and Brother Godfrey just can't catch him. Ivan Bowen is first to finish and wins the title. He's shorn 20 kicking, protesting sheep in 26 minutes. Seconds later, McDonald is through, but he surrenders second place to Godfrey Byrne, who beats him on workmanship points. The first Golden Shears Championship is over, and in years to come, this event will continue to bring together in competition the best shearers in the world.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for bearing with us. We've uh, just a few things we're sorting out with the prizes. Um, but uh, first up, we'd like to invite Ken McPherson up, and uh, he's uh, representing the sponsors of the senior, sp senior event, Supreme Automotive Refinishes. Ken McPherson. I think they're still uh, having a bit of a discussion down there. Ken, you want to make your way up to the stage, please? She was a little bit different this year. We had uh, a little bit of a kids event going on down the back, which I think is great for the community and uh, bringing these young ones in. You know, it, uh, I think that's what's missing these days in the wool sheds is we don't have enough young ones in. But Ken McPherson, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, good evening, everybody. Um, I just want to say a, words on, uh, a couple of words on behalf of um, Supreme Panel Beaters. Um, I've known Rion for a fair period of time and he's just started up his own business a few years ago and uh, had a bit of a yarn to him and he was dead keen to help out with a bit of sponsorship for this event um, and hopefully he'll carry on helping us out in the future so good on you Rion and um, we'll look forward to a bit more money from you in time. <laughs> Thank you very much Ken. Oh, we've got a bit of a noisy crowd up there. Can you guys just tone it down a little bit? We've got prize giving going on. Hoi hoi. Okay, in first place, with a time of 21.040, from Gore, Lionel Tomata. Okay, Lionel, you're just going to have to say a few words. Now, tell me, she was a bit of a battle tonight, you and Cody Gregg. You know, tell us what was happening in there. Yeah, give it to me them first two times there. Um, just didn't hit it right. Um, first of all, I'd just like to thank the sponsors of Golden Shares, um, Pi for doing the sheep, and everyone for coming. Cheers. Well done, mate. Just have him. Okay, in second place, we have Jade Maguire from Winton. She's an all South Island affair. Okay, and we have a, a few spot prizes here. We've got a haircut. Special draw at the barber shop. And that goes to Ramon Smith, Ross Thompson, and Paul Aston. So you guys come up, you guys have got a free haircut. Is it free? Oh, you guys have got an expiry date on this haircut. I think it expires in the morning. And it's a compulsory haircut too, Toma. I'm only kidding. Okay, so uh, these are our senior champions, ladies and gentlemen. You wanna, can you get a photo? Just worth a mention, we had Cody Gregg and Steve Jane. They, uh, they were the other finalists, but they sort of didn't quite reach the quality benchmark. Can I please have Duncan Mackay come to the stage? He is the Cavalier representative. Cavalier, they sponsored the Open, and uh, she was a fair old battle up there. They put up a lot of money and uh, it's a big part of their business. Thank you, Duncan. Thank you. Um, good evening, everyone, and uh, it's been a, quite a night, a few ups and downs, and um, quite exciting. And, you know, the skill of the sharers and the enthusiasm of the crowd um, has really contributed to, to a great event, um, which we're proud to support. Um, just a little bit about Cavalier Bull Scouts. Um, we are currently putting through about 9,500 farm bales a week. So we're full capacity and um, long may it run. Hopefully the prices will come up a bit. Um, anyway, down to the uh, event itself. 
Um, first prize is to Digger Balm from Tikawiti with uh, 18.244 seconds. Good effort. Well done, mate. That's awesome. Yeah, many thanks to uh, Cavalier. They've been uh, sponsoring this event for a few years. I think it's the first time I've had a collect for a couple of years, so it's um, bloody good. Uh, thanks to the guys that prepared the lambs. Excellent. It's good to come down and um, sort of put on a bit of a show rather than slugging it out on a bloody uh, to do and taking about 40 seconds. Um, and just uh, thanks to uh, Golden Shears for putting it on. Our second prize is to Parata Abraham from Masterton with uh, 24.231 seconds. Digger Baum does it again, ladies and gentlemen. He's come back from nowhere and taken it out. And it's good to see Pirates are up here. He's very consistent. Also worth a mention, we have Brett Roberts and Javan. Their quality wasn't quite up to standards, right? You've got another couple of prizes? Yeah, we have uh, uh, spot prizes um, from the barbershop Fondly, I think it's called. Uh, free haircuts. Um, Floyd Neal, Tikawiti, if you'd like to come up here and collect your card for a free haircut. Not here, gone. Okay, uh, the next one is Axel Reed from Tai Happy. Not here either, okay. Yeah, and Jimmy Samuels from Martin. Come on up, Jimmy. Come and get your free haircut. I think, oh, I think they do do perms. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us this evening. Uh, we'll be starting again at quarter to eight in the morning with the, uh, I think it's with the open wall handling. So hopefully we'll see you guys in the morning. Thank you very much. Drive safely. <laughs>